with Danny Gilligan, who's rode a double today. Well done, Danny. Good day so far. Yeah, it's been great. Thank God, yeah. Uh, looks like with the ground now softening up with all this rain, patience is a big thing today, isn't it? A lot of horses going out hard on front. Yeah, I did the last race. The, your man went off a million in front and just took my time and it paid off in the end, thank God. And on West Boots, your first winner, I must say, you gave him a peach just to get up on the line. <laughs> yeah, he's a he's sort of a, a lovable rogue. Like you can't you can't go at him with the stick or else he'll pack it in. And uh, I kept I done a lot of roaring with him up the straight and just got up in the nick of time, thank God. You probably helped that horse being in front, giving you a lead, something to aim at the exactly, whole way. Exactly, yeah. I sort of didn't want to switch out until I had one last run of it because I think if he hit the front, he, he'd stop as well. So I sort of kept him behind him and then I switched him out last minute and just got up, thank God. You rode what, around roughly 80 winners pony racing? Around that, yeah. Um, it's It's been grand, yeah. Good. And right now in the summer then, you were in Andy Slattery's last week and back to school then I take it in September? Yeah. <laughs> Sure, look, I, I don't want to go back, but I'll be made. But I was down in Andy's last week, yeah, it was great, yeah. And you turn 16 in the new year, so the plan would be hopefully turn apprentice then? Yeah, I'd try to get a season on the flat, but if it looks out of the question, sure. That's obviously I, because of weight. Yeah, I'm sure. I'm sure Dad will have plenty of horses there to jump a hurdle with, so. And any plans, or is it too far away, or any plans looking forward to the new year in terms of where you might try and place yourself in the yard? I'm trying to get out to get as much experience as I can across a couple of different yards but I've done I spent a lot of time down in Andy Slattery's there two summers ago I spent a full summer away from home and I love it down there and it's a great experience good well watching you riding in these pony races I'm sure you'll have no problem come January getting a job as an apprentice anyway listen well done very best luck for the rest of the day and big day tomorrow so uh, yeah. best luck with that as well thanks a million thanks Crab winning trainer or hand or whatever way you want to put it <laughs> you of, the, of the mile and a quarter race ridden by Connor Walsh. I spoke to Connor a couple of years ago in James Doyle's one morning. By God, he's, he's a good rider, isn't he? Yeah, good rider. He's it's his second thing to win them this year now. He won a mile and a half last week. He won well, and the soft ground doesn't seem to hindrance him too much. So, I'm happy. There was a lot of horses fancied in this beforehand, and bipolar one handy in the end. Bipolar Blondie, sorry, one handy in the end for you. How, how long do you have the horse, Shane? Uh, I have him three years now. Oil with the COVID and everything, he sat in the field. Right. So he's back going again now, and he's going well. So I'm happy. Your man, <laughs> there's a trophy fall, and you're, you're yeah. man into a lot of things. You, you're very good with half bred horses. You're farrier, and you've a couple, three of these horses as well for pony yeah, racing. Yeah, three for that. Just messing around. So the kids are happy going on a Sunday, and it gives them something to do, and it keeps me <laughs> activating and operating. Because if I was at home. Be led very easily, you know yourself, Dave. Yeah, I do. <laughs> but isn't it great to see this up here? Crowds here, the bookies are here. It's brilliant, isn't it? It's brilliant to have it back. It's very well ran. It's the first time up here. Track's brilliant. It's very safe track for jockeys, horses, everything. Look, we can't complain. If we get back here a few times a year, we'll be doing very well. And will you run this horse again soon? He runs in the derby tomorrow, two mile derby. Jesus. Yeah. The first time over two mile. See, sure. it can get an easy race if it's not for him. And It'll answer another question. Well, listen, best of luck tomorrow. Well done today. Thanks, Dave. Thank you.